What happened? It just fell into my eye. You were right underneath it? Yeah, I was looking up because obviously it's on the ceiling. <laughs> what the heck am I supposed to do? It's like in my eyeball. Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. Today we're gonna start working on our office. Mm -hmm. We're actually going to redo it and we're really excited about it. So since we work from home, like our office is one of our like most important rooms and I think that's kind of why we wanted to start with it. What we had before was just two small desks. We worked out of this really small area in our old apartment. It was probably 10 feet by five feet. Like it was an oversized closet effectively, just big enough to have that separate area. But now that we have a whole room for it, um, we're super excited to have a bigger desk um, and just kind of make it a space where we actually want to be and not uh, feel like it's just kind of like the only area to have it. Now that we've been in our house, I feel like it's been fun to like to decorate and redo mm -hmm. things. There used to be some like water damage for the ceilings and like the roof's all good now and it's been redone, but you know, when our ceilings kind of leak to kind of sometimes crack. So we're actually gonna kind of try to like scrape that off and like redo it so it's totally smooth. Yeah, so um, today we're gonna be clearing out the room um, and just getting it ready to be worked on. Here's the room, all empty. Clearly it's very ugly. So this is kind of what we were talking about. Like, they kind of have this like trim piece here, but it's kind of really gunked it up. So yeah, hopefully I think once we do the wall, it's gonna be looking really good. And then this is what we're gonna start working on today, is just kind of this old water damage. So gonna have to scrape it off, do some things and so we're gonna show you some of the things we got to fix the walls inside. Um, I'll just run through some of the stuff we got. So we got a drop cloth. Um, once we fix the ceiling, we wanted to get some ceiling white just to make sure that looks like a fresh coat of white on there. We got rollers, we got some tape to fix some of the seams, uh, gloves, masks, some paint trays. This is for um, some of the joint compound we're gonna put on. So um, we got like a tray and some knives here. Um, we also have some trowels coming in the mail, so we'll have both options there. Um, these are typically better for like doing joints and edges. Um, and then we got our joint compound down here. Um, this is just a premix bucket of it. Uh, you can get the powder, but um, we don't know what we're doing, so we got the premix. So we're on our way to the store because we realized we don't have a tool. We thought we did, but might have been my parents so we're actually on our way to McClendon's to go find some sort of like scraper knife to like chip off the ceiling I'll be that silver silver line into the story if you thought that I would turn and run then y'all don't know me May my fears rest in peace cause that's a old me got this taste on my tongue I crave the glory What happened? It fell into my eye. You were right underneath it? Yeah, I was looking up because obviously it's on the ceiling. What the heck am I supposed to do? It's like in my eyeball. <laughs> <laughs> like it's literally glued my eyeball. Okay, let me see. It's very red. <sighs> I think I'm gonna be blind. No, it's, can you just go to the other sink where we can like, you know, like point the water directly in your eyeball? Gasoline in my veins, be the fuel through my pain. Oh, I... Wow, that was the worst thing ever. Like the second we start, as you can see, it just plops right into my open eye. And it's like, what do you do? Obviously you automatically blink. So then, 
It's going into my eye. I pretty much have like cement in my eye. As we rise, rise from the flames, heart of a lion. Day two, got my glasses on, so no more blops going in my eye. And we're gonna skim coat the whole ceiling. Never sing, never cried like a diamond, shine under pressure. Oh, it's time to fire hold up. Okay, so it's been a few days and. Last time didn't yeah. go so well for us. Uh, the other day we started doing it, everything was too thick, we're getting glumps, clumps. Clumps. <laughs> so today we have a new strategy. We're gonna dilute the mixture with water and we're gonna roll it on. We saw someone in a video do this and so we're gonna give it a try because we don't know what else to do. So, um, here we go. Shine on the pressure, oh it's time to fire, hold up. Oh it's time to fire, hold up. It is day something. And we got the skin coat on the ceiling yesterday and that method Definitely works a lot better. Yeah. So we're gonna do a second coat, and honestly, I think that will like be good. I think. Yeah. Hopefully, this is the last coat because yeah. yeah. And there's totally like some issues with the ceiling, but it was kind of like we should do the ceiling so we can do like the part we actually wanted to do. Yeah. So. No, it looks a lot better. Yeah. Um, but yeah, hopefully this last coat will kind of smooth things out, and we should be good to go. Now it's time to fire on up. Last little thing. It's not gonna let it dry. Honestly, it's looking really good. Like you can't really see like the really bad area that we were trying to fix, and it's pretty smooth. So I would give this a thumbs up so far, but we'll see. So this is like day something. We are gonna put the third coat on. Yeah. Hopefully that's the last coat. We think it's looking really good, but we think one more coat will do it. I know it doesn't look like anything is happening, but we can assure you that it is. Again, and the ceiling is all the way dry, so now we're going to sand off the different rough parts. It's gonna be dusty, it's gonna be a nightmare, but it's looking good, so. So, we didn't think this video would be like very long because I don't think we really anticipated the ceiling taking like so long, but it's taken like so many more days than we thought, which is totally fine. It ended up being a really fun process, and I feel like we didn't know if the final result would be like looking pretty good, but it's really coming along. So that wasn't gonna continue working. So I saw a video where this guy had like a sander on like a pole, and that seemed to work really well. So we're gonna try that tomorrow. Yeah, that was just gonna hurt her hands. So uh, I am completely dusted. Yeah, you can't really tell, but you're... it just looks. I just have powdered my face. That's all it is. <laughs> they just made your hair look really like yeah, white. I got it like kind of frosted, you know. So we'll see you tomorrow. All right. So our sander on a stick has been working out really well. We just got these, and we kind of just sanded off the ceiling, and that really helped. I feel like we were able to get it like really smooth. Yeah. Uh, it's really dusty though. <laughs> it's very dusty. They say the struggle is real. I say the struggle reveals how you deal with the monster that's inside. So would you say you got dusted? Completely dusted. <laughs> I don't buy into the luck. I put my faith in my trust in my team. Everything that we done been through. So, what are we doing now? We're painting the ceiling. Yes, this is the final step of the ceiling, which is very exciting. It yes. It's been quite the process. It looks the same probably on camera, but it looks a lot better in person. So, we're yeah. excited to get it done. Ah, gasoline in my veins, be the fuel through my pain. Oh. Obviously, you can tell that 
Doesn't look like there's any water damage right on this part. And that was literally the main part. So yeah, honestly it looks great. I feel like it's like as good as we could have hoped for, for our first shot. And we do plan to do the other two rooms in our house. So hey, should be good. All right, so we are done with the ceiling. We're feeling like this is kind of getting a little long, so feel free to like and subscribe so you can stay along with the rest of the series. We got other things we're gonna do to this room. So that's the best way to, uh, yeah, stay in the loop. All right, yeah. I mean, the rest of the fun parts are next, yeah. so <laughs> it only gets better from here. All right, see ya. Hey, hey, hey.